I achieved this look by using the new Kashi Rose palette. If you're interested in seeing this palette and wanting to know what I think about it, just keep on watching. In this video, I'm going to review and use the new palette from Kesha. It's called Kesha Rose. It's beautiful. I've seen this and I've, I had to have it just for the packaging alone. But that's not the real reason why I bought it. Just look at these beautiful colors. Now, these colors are up my alley. I love these colors, every single one of them. So that's why, the real reason why I bought it, because I love the colors. It does have a nice mirror, and as you see, it flips completely back. If you need to use it, you just turn it like this. Because so I was wondering how I use it, holding it up, because it's flimsy. Uh, well, not. I wouldn't say flimsy, that's not made well. It's made well, but it would fall, okay? But you leave it flipping down like this and just hang on to it and you got your mirror. How ingenious. I love it. Okay, but I'm gonna get some colors on my eyes. I'll give you my review after I put it on and tell you how I like it. Oh, I have used this several times, so this is not a first impression. I've been using this palette and I've been basically using the pinks, the maroons. I, what else have I used? Yeah, I guess just those. Can't remember. <laughs> but I'm gonna go for something. Oh, I've used the red too. And I don't think I've used the orange. That's the only color that I, I usually don't wear, but I'll try it. <laughs> I think I'm gonna use the greens today. Go for something different. I love green. I'm gonna go in with dinosaur. As my transition. And they're quite buttery and smooth. Really nice, nice quality. Never heard of this company. It's called, what is this company called? I guess that's important. Uh, I remember, does it say on here? Yeah, it's a hip dot brand. I never heard of that brand, so I guess it's an indie brand. I, I assume so. Okay, let's get going. A little dinosaur is my base. Godzilla, right here. color right here this is applying quite nicely with the brush let's see what it applies like with my finger probably better Real good. But it does apply nice with a brush, with a nice brush. This is the Wayne Goss brush, though. So I'm not sure about the synthetic bristles. I'm not an expert at this. Far from it. But I have learned a few things. 
Okay, all green. Hmm. Do I like it? I don't know. You never know until you get finished. We're going for it. But the other colors are really nice. I know, I, you know, maybe I should show this to you. It's gorgeous. This silver color. I have worn that a lot. It's tick tock. Supple in the hair. Just watch. Grab my little pinky. Just a little bit. And we will just kind of pat it on. Gives it a little bit of a pop. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go off camera now and finish the other eye. Just did my brows off camera. I used the Brow Gal eye pencil, eyebrow pencil. I just really, really enjoyed this eyebrow pencil. I'm not one to do my eyebrows. Sometimes I forget. <laughs> About 80% of the time, I have nice thick eyebrows, and I don't even. I pluck them, but they're thick, so I get to it. <laughs> but, so I just want to pop on and tell you what eyebrow pencil I used. And I'm finished with the eyeshadow. I really think it turned out good. What do you think? Every time I use this palette and I Put these colors on they oh i don't know if that look good ah they just to me they're beautiful i think if you like i would like to do some more combinations and just do a video just on different eye looks edit it you know so you just see the eye look and uh maybe you'll like that i hope i can get to it soon I'm trying to get caught up i I don't know how some of these YouTubers do it and upload every day. I don't know. But anyway, I would do my best. This is a finger swatch. This is a brush watch. I did run through them twice. <laughs> 